an original letter and an Easter card written by an SS officer who guarded the Nazi concentration camp Auschwitz has gone on display. The letter sent to the museum by an anonymous donor dates from April 1, 1944, and includes a postcard depicting German tanks. This is a very special document for our collection, as we did not have any letters or postcards privately sent by any member of the Auschwitz crew. Here we can see the daily life of the camp through the eyes of a member of the SS crew. The Auschwitz Memorial made an appeal in January to Germans and Austrians to donate any documents they may have from the Nazi era. After World War II, many tried to hide their shame and whitewash themselves by eliminating every trace, and most never admitted their guilt. Memories of survivors, witnesses and victims of the Holocaust are shown in the museums and camps all around Europe. But it's rare to find memories, letters and private photographs of soldiers who worked at the camps. We have very few of such private documents that would show the world of the perpetrators, their motivations, their problems, their ordinary day here in Auschwitz. It must be remembered that people were working here, fathers, husbands, and that on the one hand they were part of this extermination machine, but on the other hand they were humans. Their motives should be known to understand how great evil can be. More than a million people, mainly European Jews, were gassed, shot or hanged at the camp or died of neglect, starvation or disease before the Soviet Red Army entered its gates in early 1945 during its decisive advance on Berlin.